Gary Neville's complete Man United U-turn after best four teams in Europe claim. Gary Neville's criticism of Manchester United following their embarrassing defeat to Liverpool is a million miles away from the bold claim he made just weeks earlier. The Red Devils are in the midst of a poor run of form, losing five of their last nine in all competitions. Performances have left a lot to be desired, but things peaked on Sunday when the Reds won 5-0 at Old Trafford. It leaves United shell-shocked and with major questions being asked of Ole Gunnar Solskjaer as Antonio Conte waits in the wings. The Norwegian has been given time and money with the likes of Cristiano Ronaldo arriving the summer. However the gulf between them and the Premier League's leading trio, Manchester City, Liverpool and Chelsea, is stark. United finished second last term, but some of their closest rivals endured their own troubles and that league position looks more and more deceiving by the week. Have your say. Is time up for Solskjaer at Manud? Comment below the Red Devils boss declared the defeat to Jurgen Klopp's side is darkest day as the tough fixtures continue to come thick and fast. Tottenham, Atalanta and City are United's next three games and the poor set of results could get even worse. Neville has continued to back Solskjaer, whom he played alongside for years, which has seen him come in for criticism. The Sky Sports pundit waxed lyrical about the quality of England's top flight only last month. Chelsea are European champions, City and Liverpool have set the standard recently, whilst United have invested under Solskjaer. It saw Neville claim that the quartet were arguably the best teams on the globe. He said on Sky Sports we could have the four best teams in the whole world at this moment in time. Liverpool's first Zai, if they can keep that fit, is possibly the best Zai in the Premier League. And Liverpool aren't even being talked about at the moment. Manchester City's team is exceptional, Chelsea are strong like you wouldn't believe, and Manchester United, with the addition of Cristiano Ronaldo, Jadon Sancho and Rafael Varane, are going to be right in there amongst it. Two English clubs, Chelsea and Man City, reached the Champions League final last season, while Man United played in the final of the Europa League. The Ballon d'Or shortlist has been released. Vote for your winner below. Just weeks later, though and Neville claimed United aren't close to winning Europe's elite club competition or their domestic one. Solskjaer's side lost their Champions League opener to young boys but have since picked up successive wins. Successes over Villarreal and Atalanta have covered up serious cracks with the performances well below par. Neville said on Sunday, I don't think they're close to winning the league. I don't think they are close to winning the Champions League. I don't think they are close to Man City, Liverpool or Chelsea at the moment. Solskjaer has come out defiantly, insisting he has come too far as United boss to walk away now. Neville though believes the gulf between United and their rivals is a major concern. He added, Ole